How's it going guys? It's Ryan here and welcome to loot from 100 lava strike worms uh, So they came out earlier today and I actually managed to uh, kill 100 of them And I found a strategy that worked really well Which is basically once they pull you under and you run away That's when you use your, your thresholds because you know that they're not gonna pull you in right away And I basically did that for 100 kills and it took me like an hour and a couple minutes probably an hour 10 minutes uh, now in terms of drops well you'll you'll see it in a second but this is the drop that happened oh my god oh I thought that was like the drop drop but it wasn't the drop drop it was just a drop um, yeah the trolls were real uh, this guy attacked me that's why I didn't get a skull when I attacked him he tried to like double AGS spec me so I was like uh -uh, that ain't happening he can't do that to me then he was trying to recruit other people to kill me and be like oh my god he tried to kill me even though I didn't so I said, you know what, I've had it with you, I'm going to kill you now. Uh, so that's exactly what I did. I included his loot in the final price check, although, I mean, his loot wasn't exactly phenomenal. It probably upped it by, like, maybe 80, 90k. Not a massive deal, and he even failed at trying to go through the tunnel and do that that whole business. Uh, but yeah, we killed him for all his things, and that was amazing, and it felt good. Um, but yeah, in terms of PKing, it's really easy to escape if a PKer comes and tries to kill you. Just make sure you've got an Amulet of Glory or a level 30 teleport, and then basically all you gotta do is you gotta teleport uh, uh, a little bit south. So you run south like five or six wildy levels depending on where you're killing them. Uh, and then you teleport with your glory back to Edgewell and it's easy as that. All right, so now let's put everything in the price checker and find out how much money we made in an hour and five or an hour and 10 minutes. Uh, by the way, in terms of setup, I was wearing full Death Lotus with Death Lotus darts as my three items that would protect. Uh, and it actually worked out really, really well for me. Uh, so yeah, as you can see, 1.8 mil and then the 114 ashes. Uh, now the thing about the ashes is their guide price in GE for some reason is only 1.7k, uh, even though they're going for about 8k right now and they're probably going to stay that way just because they're very, very good for uh, prayer training. Uh, so basically that's another 900k that gets added to the price check. Uh, so that's quite good. It was about 2.5 mil an hour, I would say, but uh, like I said before, it totally depends on how many PKers are out. Um, now the next thing is the sharks, the magic beautiful sharks of awesome. These are pretty much the best PKing food in the game. They're kind of like juju gumbos. Basically what they do is they heal 230 hit points and then they heal an additional 50 hit points over time afterwards. Uh, so that's actually really cool. Uh, and they're actually untradeable, so you gotta get them through, through that. Uh, so yeah, anyway guys, that's loot from 100 uh, Lava Strike Worms. Unfortunately, I didn't get any of the uh, level 85 weapons, uh, but we'll see what happens in the coming days. So anyway guys, thanks so much for watching, have a good one, and peace.